Hello, welcome. This is Awesome Time, episode 109. We are going to be showing off all these awesome new products with Eric. I'm gonna be dueling him in some sort of cool card game. So stick around, we're gonna have a lot of fun. Okay, it's time for another sponsorships and outstanding reviews and recommendations, yeah, segment. I'm really excited about this chair that the folks from Yahi Tech sent me. They are a new sponsor of Awesome Time. Let me get up so you can see the chair. This is their gaming chair. Super ergonomic, very comfortable. Quick feature roll call, you got the wide armrest here, padded headrest, the mesh. You can uh, obviously raise it up, lower it, because it's pneumatic, and then I can slide this little lever right there, boom, you just heard it click, and I can, I can get my lean on. This chair is available in a bunch of different colors and it is extremely affordable. Check out the link in the description below for where you can buy this chair. Thanks to Yahi Tech for hooking us up with this awesome gaming chair. Question, how do you make tic-tac-toe more exciting? Answer, prick your fingers and do it in blood. Golden gummy challenge. Okay, that is a terrible idea, Eric. We will do a golden gummy challenge later. Okay. This is Otrio, and this is a much safer and better way to make tic-tac-toe more exciting. Otrio is from our friends over at Marbles, the brain store, and they have come up with a really cool game that's simple to understand. You're trying to get three in a row, just like tic-tac-toe, but instead of nine spots, there's 27. You can play two to four people. Let me show you the different ways that you can make an Otrio. So you can get three of the same size in a row. Another way is you can do three in a row descending or ascending. Or you can get three concentric circles in one spot. So you can see instantly that it's easy to understand, but there's also a lot of strategy going on. If you were, for instance, playing against someone and they throw this down, well, you could put this piece here, boom, now they can't do three in a row. Or if you go there, you're blocking them from doing the descending thing. This is not like tic-tac-toe in which every game ends in a cat's game. This is Otrio and it's only available at Vat19 and Marbles the Brain Store. I love the 80s and nothing is more 80s than a Nintendo. So that is why I love this next product, Game Cartridge Flasks. These look almost identical to a Nintendo cartridge, but instead of playing awesome games, it's uh, for getting your drank on. Pull out this stopper right here and, you know. Mm. Mm. Um, for comparison's sake, here's an original Duck Hunt, here's Drunk Hunt, extremely Similar. So you got Drunk Hunt and Super Bar Hop Bros. Anybody that loves retro video games or is a kid of the 80s, this is a perfect gift for them. This is the game cartridge flask. Speaking of the 80s, Gremlins playing cards. Made in the USA, officially licensed with original artwork. Here's what the back looks like. You got a, a Gremlin and you got like Gizmo's little fingers there. Here's a regular old card. Let me show you a couple of the face cards. You got Gizmo, the most adorable. We got a talk show host gremlin, I think, or a, a brainy gremlin, I'm not sure. News anchor gremlin. You got like a chef gremlin. <laughs> The ever famous lightning bolt gremlin, and one of the jokers is the is the flasher gremlin. <laughs> I'm gonna start shuffling these up because the gremlins playing cards are this episode's golden gummy challenge. So I'm gonna invite Eric in here. I'm down by two. It's time for me to get one here. Hilarious as usual. Today we will be betting jelly beans. <laughs> In a game the internet calls Blind Man's Bluff. You're going to draw a card from the deck, you're gonna stick it to your forehead, so okay. I can see it and the camera can see it, but you can't see it. All right, so what do we do now? All right, so now we bet our jelly beans, so I'll give you 10 jelly beans. Okay. And you gotta bet your jelly beans that, my... that your card is higher. I'll go in three jelly beans. Okay, I will see your three. I'm gonna raise you one. That's how confident I'm feeling. I will call. You're gonna call? I'm gonna call right here. Yeah! No! What? <laughs> Seven beats a six. That, that can't be good. it. We're gonna play yeah, again, we'll right? Play again. I'm going all in. You're son. going all in. I'm going all in. Okay. I'll call. Okay. What do we got? Yes! Yeah, the it. king. All right. 
<laughs> Going all in. All right. Call. Okay. Oh, dang it! No, you oh, won. Oh, I won? Yeah, Queen's better than Jack. Oh. I won! <laughs> I want all the beans and I didn't even know it. All right, fine. Bring in that stupid box of stupid punishment. Winner gets to place and remove two oh, boo-boo bandages You got from some the hairy arms, arms, too. That one's kind of gross looking. That's got like oh, maggots gross. in there. Like, oh. That's all right. pretty gross looking. So first one, I'll try to do the old band-aid style where you rip it fast. One, two, three. Oh. Oh, gross. <laughs> that kind of stinks, son. Yeah, there's a, there's lot, a of lot of hair, hair on there. <laughs> this yeah. one, we're gonna torture him. <laughs> oh! Just finish it! Finish it! That's that red! Kind of That's red! Alright, get out of here! I need everyone to just start hashtagging Team Jamie and get this thing going. Alright, after that game of pure chance, I think it's good to bring in a game of pure Strategy. This is Stratosphere. The object of the game is to get your spheres to the bottom of this thing first. You get four, your opponent gets four. You also get these sliders. This is what you're gonna be inserting into the cube and notice that the circular hole is in different spots on different sliders. You've gotta decide where you wanna put your sliders into the cube. Once you and your opponent have put in all of your sliders, you drop in your four spheres. So there's a lot of strategy involved in just setting up the game. Each turn, you can move one of these sliders in or out one spot. You're trying to get your balls all the way down to the bottom before they do. This is a great gift for anyone that likes puzzles or strategy games, so this is the stratosphere. I love snacks. Do you guys see how beautiful this is? I just wanna hug it and squeeze it. Oh, I love food and snacks. Oh, huh, not as squishy as I was hoping. Oh, this is way better to cuddle with. These are comfort food squishables. Look at the size of these. Cupcake with a cherry on top, soft serve ice cream, and cinnamon roll. So squishy, so big. All right, folks, those are comfort food squishables. A lot less messy to hug these than the real thing. Before we move on, I want to remind all of you to follow us on social media. That's Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. We do giveaways every Friday. All right, Kara, fly it on into me. Oh, all right. This is the RC combat helicopter. I know what you're thinking. Oh, I've seen remote controlled helicopters before. Well, maybe not like this one. What makes this one so cool is the remote control. It's an intuitive flight stick control. So if I bring her up, if I tilt forward, she flies forward. If I tilt it back, she flies back. And if I lean, she turns. Look at that. Hey. Not bad! To quickly recap, if you lean this forward, she goes forward. If you lean it back, she goes backwards. And then if you twist your hand to one side or the other, the bird turns that direction. What also makes these combat helicopters is that you can get up to seven other friends and fight each other with these using infrared. And if you hit somebody else, it disables them and they fall down. They're extremely durable. These are really cool RC helicopters from Propel. These guys know how to make the good stuff. Okay, this is a product that's actually really useful. This Bondic is really cool. Everyone should have this in their repair kit arsenal or whatever. It is a liquid welder. It does all of the things that a glue does as far as sticking things together, but it works in a very different way. On one side, you've got a UV light. On the other, we've got the pen, which you can squeeze the liquid out of. That liquid will not set until you shine the UV light on it. So that allows you to do some interesting things. Check out this key fob. It had a hole in it, in the plastic up here, and we were able to put some Bondic on, cure it. Put another layer on, cure it, to build this up. Let me give you another example. Look at the teeth of this gear here. So one was missing and we were able to build another one. You can sand Bondic once it's been cured. You can paint it as well. Let's do a, a demo of how the curing works. I'm gonna try to glue this ceramic mug to here. So I'm gonna start by putting some of the Bondic glue here. Now that will not set. I mean, I could leave that forever. If I 
put this on here. This is just gonna smear around. If I let go, it would just fall and this will just come right off. If I shine the UV light on the Bondic, it only takes about four seconds in each spot. So this liquid cures with UV light. I can already feel it like sticking onto this. Yeah, that's it. It's cured. There's so many great applications for Bondic and as I said, the liquid never dries out. So go ahead and pick yourself up some Bondic and start fixing all those things around your house that need fixing. That 19 needs your help. We want to find out what parts of awesome time you like the most. There's a poll, click the little spot right up here and please just click which is your favorite part of awesome time and by helping us out, we'll be able to give you more of the segments you like the most. Okay, let's do some fan art. That was an amazing collection of fan art. I loved every single one of them so much. If you want to send in your own fan art, here is the address. Send it in and you can see it on a future episode of Awesome Time. It's time to wrap this episode up. Got my new chair. Yeah, it swivels good. Um, make sure you check out all of these videos around me. We've been working hard and I think the videos are amazing. Don't miss a single one of them. Watch all of them. And as always, subscribe to us on social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. We do weekly giveaways. As always, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And we'll see you next time. That 19. Oh.